Mona Lisa. <laughs> what happened there? Mona Lisa is still broody on an empty nest. Doodle bug and cotton. They've got no idea what happened to their playground. Their playground has been worked into the garden. Thank you, Cornelius. It was a mountain and we also did this over that's also been done over so this is the full effect of this project now really completed except for the fact that I must paint and I'm not done in the garden completely yet. I must do a few pots over there. Um, only the little ones, not the big one. I've also completed this. <laughs> Changed this. I've put that uh, plant in the back there. I thought it's a better place for it. I have done the little water feature. Also completed down there. But here they are coming. It's cold. I hope he's walking like that because it's cold. He loves loyal for some other reason. I don't like it if the wings are spread out like that and they walk like the hunchback of Notre Dame. Then I normally feel that they feel sick. Maybe it's just cold. He's not really grazing, he's just walking people. Mm. Is there trouble in paradise? Maybe he made an effort. Maybe he's not quite fully awake yet. We'll see. Mm. You can't save the world, Sunit. You can't save the world. And I'm just made a, a rock feature there. I must do this plant over. But I think I'm going to mess it up if I do. I think I must just put some fertilizer and fresh soil in. There are two little ones that came up here in the back, which I must pot still. I haven't completed this yet. This is the next project that I'm going to complete. Just a little path. Look, the guavas, little guavas are coming on. And these are pots that I must still work with. And my wisteria, which now I don't know what to do with. <laughs> Can you believe that? I was pestering everybody for the wisteria and now <clears throat> the people are confusing me. And so I mustn't do what I want to do. Wait, Sunit, wait, don't do that. So, um, that has become one of my favorite places to sit now, believe it or not. progress <laughs> I just need to show you before the wind destroys everything come along come along lavender and raven has become the biggest chums on this planet moving around together lavender very protective of raven lavender is 
Actually, now I'm quite a bit chicken. I must see what goes on. But now I must wait till the raven is big before I put them um, with the ducks. I we'll have to uh, supervise whatever is going to happen there. And then we have this doodle bug now. Doodle bug and cotton. And I took Mona Lisa out. Where did Mona Lisa go now? She must stretch her legs a bit. The bees are actually working these flowers as well. Look at that. Everybody asked me why I don't do this underneath my um, stones that I throw, that's why. My brain will not be able to handle it, I think it looks ugly. And it comes out everywhere, it's just not, I don't like that look at all. Look there. No, thank you. I've got to do the hard work. Look at this. Just look at this. I'm so pleased. I'm so happy. I'm so pleased. Man. <laughs> I could not have wished for better. I just could not. It's half past six in the morning. I've got a burst of energy before Cornelius come and um, a few tidy up things here in the back just to keep things nice with all the hard work and look what's happening here. We are finally also just refreshing this uh, you can't call this pebbles. <laughs> What would you call this? No, whatever. <laughs> whatever is going on here, it is getting tidied up and freshened up. Uh, the bags, you know, that's when we clean the chicken and the duck coop. We can't put it there by the gate because Bella will throw them over, through it all over the place. And that's putting me in an instant bad mood if I wake up and I must first go and rake stuff that's already been done and um, I just want to tidy up some of the pots here the amarilla worm has been very busy the amarilla has finished flowering so I can actually cut the, the leaves off I do not want other stuff in the pots just a little bit of tiny stuff I'm actually letting these little I forgot what their name is. I will look it up again and title it in the video. I actually just let it take over because it's actually looking quite nice. It gives like a um, a field effect, a nature foresty <laughs> kind of effect. And the um, ponytail palm that got knocked off when the tree fell over is coming out nicely just look at that yeah. things need to reacclimatize here yeah? because it used to be in the shade and now it's in the full sun I have a story to tell about this uh, cycad um, the two others are there um, at the garden path I will show you them and just mention the story then. About 25 years ago, my dad ordered me cycads and Mandela Gold Strelitzia from Christian Bosch Nursery in Cape Town. It came in a bubble-wrapped envelope. It was so small. Five cycads. I lost two. Not because of the fact that they came in an envelope but for me transplanting it too many times I couldn't make up my mind where I want it um, very difficult to plant something if you don't know how big it's going to get this is not plant actually quite in the in the right place because 
that's a, a, a walkway and the leaves are quite thorny and it can hurt you. In any case, uh, three survived and one Strelitzia Mandela Gold survived. I think there were two Strelitzias and five Psycats of the same, the Psycats were all of the same, same kind. And this is one of them. They were so small, they came in an envelope, they were wrapped in wet tissue paper. And that's the way that they arrived here in Port Elizabeth, Kabarga. And that was one of them. Just wanted to tell you that story. Anyway, guys, let me get busy before this morning is over. That is happy. Uh, this evil little duck. <laughs> she became very vocal. It's Chamel's favorite quacker duck of the ones that I have. I will put clean water in there. They like to play in that. And then it's ginger. The Orpington buff. And what ginger do we have here? Bentley. My teddy bear cat. He is such a teddy bear. Bentley, look at the people. Say good morning. Good morning, friends and viewers. <laughs> Why is Puddles here? Puddles? Why are you here, Puddles? Garden path. Five. African tulip tree. The sun is just catching those top ones. Thank you. 